Today we are talking to André Lubiskanki, Executive Chairman of Straits Resources. He and his team joined Straits in December last year. André, can you please tell us what you've been able to achieve in this period? All right, look, the way we are, when we took over in December this year, we set ourselves three targets. The one is to get operations back under control and deliver results, get the debt under control and really look at the debt structures and look at the corporate overhead structure on the cost side of things. In the last 10 months, we've turned around the operations. We had record production last quarter. We've reduced the overhead structure from 29 to 6 and moved the office, so a significant reduction in corporate structures. And the next challenge is we've done some work on the debt. We had a $28 million reduction on $158 million debt. The next step is how do we get the debt further down? So where we are today and where we're going for the next six months is how do we deleverage further through various options, how do we keep continuing the production levels, and then the Myanmar asset, which is an asset we got in, 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 in Indonesia, is how do we move that out of the company. That is a gold asset which is not working for us, and we will move that out and, move, and get that move on, which leaves us as an Australian copper producer, producing about 20 five to 27,000 tonnes of copper and out of New South Wales. And then, so where we are now, the market is looking for three things. Get the debt down even further, produce results, and get rid of that matter. That's where we are.